Stop recording. Check. Okay. So yesterday we have studied what are the types of data and its sources. So today we are going to open the Excel and we are going to create some tables. Means some tables means we are actually going to enter data in Excel. There are different formats of data or there uh, there is different uh, data set means there are different data sets which are treated uh, differently in Excel. <coughs> Some are numbers, some are dates, some are uh, symbols, some are colors, some are like uh, the text, textual data sets like this. So let's open Excel. All of you are supposed to open Excel in front of you and just get blank workbook for yourself. Yes. yes sir. So let me present the screen in front of you and I will do all the things which I am uh, telling you to do. So you will be getting live demo also. Let me and present. Uh, disable all everyone mic because someone actually using microphone. Okay. Microphones. Now uh, what I will do, I will disable uh, all the microphones. Just you have to listen and follow the things which I am telling you. If you have any doubt in between. I may not be able to see your chats because I am going to present the screen and uh, I am going to open Excel. So uh, let your doubts uh, remain uh, unanswered for some time and after that you can ask me questions. Like or I will try to uh, take 29, your doubts in chats. Just let me join to another device button. for reading your chats so you can also message me in a chat okay so here i will disable your microphones and i will keep track of your chats host control auto button not pressed pressed unknown cursor close button turn this off my remove key let everyone turn on their microphone check box off 29.0 unknown cursor normal cursor okay so i will present my screen just for Activity auto. The perfect demo. Chat with everyone. Auto button. Show everyone. Meeting details. Leave all. More options. Menu button. Below. Present now. Menu button. Expanded. Menu light name window. Share application window dialog. Chrome wants to share the contents of your screen with me.google.com. Cancel button two of two. No, let me share the entire screen. Sell, select, I, data, sir. Clickable activity toggle button not. Check. Show everyone toggle button not red. Meeting details toggle button not. More options menu. Present now menu. Expanded. Your entire screen one of three. A window two of three. Your entire screen one of three. Type back to lucky join. Meet at advanced to sell flash I data, sir. Share your entire screen dialog from one. Entire screen grouping, entire screen button one to one. Meet at meet.google.com is sharing your screen dot. Okay. So now let me open the Excel. Search me. Excel comma app comma press right click app start cursor. Normal cursor. App start cursor. Normal cursor. Okay, now I have opened uh, the Excel and I will get blank workbook for me. Book one dash Excel, keep one table, align default, vertical, align default, a one, normal cursor. Okay, so here I am on sheet one. Now see, there are different types of data. So let's create a table in Excel which will include all the data types and we will try to enter the data uh, in the Excel. So let me join from another device uh, till the time you open Excel and uh, just 
get into the worksheet I will join for addressing your chats till the time all of you uh, just open excel So just open the uh, blank workbook and uh, now you must be aware that how to navigate around the uh, cells like left arrow, left right and up down. These are the arrow keys which you can use uh, for navigating around the sheet like down arrow will help you to navigate horizontally up down arrows will help you to navigate horizontally uh, vertically and uh, the just a minute let me join okay Okay, so just respond me in the chat box if everything is uh, perfect. Just okay, you can uh, respond me uh, in the chat box. Just let me see everything is perfect at the end and then we will start. Okay, I am getting yes. Okay, so now let's start. So this is the Excel sheet in front of me and I am in A1. A1 represents first row and first column because first letter is A and one is first uh, the column sorry one is first row so we will create uh, the tables like uh, this A2. now I am pressing down arrow for this A2 A3, A3. I am pressing down arrow now I will press right arrow for going uh, to next column B3. B3 but I am in the same row because I have pressed right arrow only B2 B2 B1 B1 so that's how you are going to navigate now you know basic computers so I hope you are, you must be aware of basic excel also so let's start with creating table so first data type is your numbers 1 2 3 4 5 6 so let's keep this column for serial numbers let's keep this first column for serial number below this column we are going to write all the serial numbers so let's make this as serial number s s r dot N -O. o this will be the shortcut for our understanding so this is serial number first column is your serial number then second column will be name let's prepare a database of students so student name second column will be student name so here text comes in T U D T F T student space A A F T name space student name this will be the second column we are creating headers third column will be a line default vertical line default C1 date of birth I will try to cover maximum data types in uh, formats of data through this table so let's make this as a date of birth let's write uh, date of birth Date of birth. 
थर्ड कॉलम विल बी डेट ऑफ बर्थ एंड वी आर राइटिंग दिस इन बिकॉज फर्स्ट रो ऑफ टेबल कंटेन्स हेडर्स सो वी आर मेकिंग दिस हेडर्स डेट ऑफ बर्थ ओके नाउ अनदर कॉलम विल बी जॉइनिंग टाइम सो वी हैव टू लर्न हाउ टू राइट टाइम इन परफेक्ट मैनर सो लेट्स कीप लेट्स मेक दिस कॉलम एज जॉइनिंग टाइम जॉइनिंग टाइम जॉइनिंग जॉइनिंग टाइम दिस विल बी द नेक्स्ट कॉलम सो वी विल बी प्रैक्टिसिंग राइटिंग टाइम्स लेट्स मेक दिस डेटा रैंडमली देर इज नो रेलिवेंस जस्ट हमें सभी तरीके के डेटा टाइप्स को प्रैक्टिस करना है हाउ टू राइट दीज थिंग्स इन परफेक्ट मैनर इन एक्सेल सो नेक्स्ट विल बी मोबाइल नंबर मोबाइल नंबर दिस विल बी द नेक्स्ट कॉलम After mobile, we are going to write email IDs. Email. At the line ID. M A I L. Mail space. I D I D space. Email ID. This will be the next column. Okay. Now let's keep another column as blood group. Here we will be using symbols. O U P space blood P O U P group space blood group Hello blood group H1 Now here admission fees because currencies bhi hame likhna aana chahiye currencies ya jo commercial amounts hai so that we will write admission fees or fees just make it as fees सो so, हमें वो पता चल जाएगा एंड उसके नीचे भी वी आर गोइंग टू प्रैक्टिस राइटिंग दिस फिगर्स और परफेक्ट वे ऑफ राइटिंग दिस फिगर्स सो लेट्स राइट इट एज फीज फीज सो दिस इज फीज Okay, now next will be the address. How to write addresses? That also we are going to take care. But we are not going to write such a big addresses today. But I will tell you uh, what is the perfect way to write the address for appropriate uses. D R E S S address. The line default vertical line default J one. Now see this address column can be divided like address then your city city slash district state and your uh, country and pin code that we will see how to do th these things or what uh, is necessary when you are dealing with this kind of data okay address uh If you remember any other uh, data format like currencies, numbers, mobile numbers, email IDs, okay, uh, other things like, so you can mention that thing in text box because all of you are working personals, so you can mention what uh, is supposed to be added in this table. Or, कोई कॉलम ऐड किया जा सकता है.
okay I am able to see the message here okay that's enough for now currency uh, we can see uh, say that kabhi kabhi you have to write amounts like like uh, the banking transactions or commercial transactions to yahan pe currency mein wo likhna padta hai wo share prices international exchange rates never know ki corporate mein aapko kab kya kaam aa jaye working mein so we should learn these things okay so that's enough for now now let's fill this table now we are going to fill this table and we are going to uh, see uh, how we should enter this data and what uh, will be the perfect way of entering this data so then uh, the data will be uniformed okay now uh, i am uh, in this cell i think j1 j1 okay now let's go to first column how to go uh, directly to first column because if you uh, press the arrow keys it will take eight arrow keys right eight or seven arrow keys but in single key you can reach to a column <coughs> that is control plus left arrow control plus left arrow will move your cursor to a1 directly like this so here i am serial number now below the serial numbers all numbers will be considered as serial number now there may be, there may be two three ways of writing serial number like you can start from 0 1 0 2 0 or you can start like 1 2 3 4 5 or you can start uh, in roman numbers also but uh, roman numbers are not useful so let's consider these two types 0 1 or 1 either you can start from 1 2 3 4 5 0 or 0 1 0 2 0 3 this will be matlab usse zyada koi fark nahi padega so doesn't matters ki aap usko kaise likhte hain so here we will start with 1 2 3 4 5 like this only 1 2 3 4 5 at all the so let's type 2 3 uh, 5 serial numbers here 5 serial numbers and align left one one Align default vertical align default Let down me. arrow and you will move to uh, the below cell or you can press enter for moving the below cell to and align, align left two align default vertical align default a four a four so I will write three and align left three four and align and five and align default vertical align default a seven I have done. One, two, three, four, five. These are the serial numbers. Now let's go to name column. Now let's go to name column. D seven. Name clock D one. D two. Now observe these things carefully. Okay. <coughs> first entry will be one, two, D two. Of only first name. First entry will be of only first name. Like J A S A S A. Tejas. because tejas is also name align default tejas d2 tejas d3 now let's do second entry in second entry you are going to write full name full name first name middle name and last name so i will write my first name middle name and last name a s j a s a E A W A R Ramsworth space and M F E B space. So this is my full name. Normal cursor. Align default vertical. Take Ramsworth needle to flow in B three. This is full name. This is second entry. Now third entry will be B four. Your first name and last name. Only first name and last name. J A S J A R space M E T E B space. so your first name and last name only this will be the third entry 
<coughs> align default vertical align default B5. Fourth entry will be like your mark sheet order. First, uh, last name, first name, and middle name. Fourth entry will be like this: last name, first name, and middle name. Like I will write my last name first. So like this, Mete they just Rameshwar. Last name, first name, and uh, the father's name or middle name, whatever it would be. So this will be the fourth entry. Or next will be a light default vertical light default B6. Completely different. Last name, first last name, middle name, or uh, let's keep it as uh, Tejas R Mete. Tejas R Mete. So let's let's keep as first name, uh, initial of middle name and uh, surname. There may be different methods of writing name. I hope you are going to get my point from these entries. So let's make it as A S A space Tejas R R space M E T E M E space Mete. Or there are other methods of writing name like Tejas M, Tejas Tejas R M. Many people write in uh, the different ways. But the difference in these names, like first entry is your first name, second is your first and last name, third is your first, middle and last, fourth is last, first and middle, and next is uh, last is uh, like for fifth entry is your first initial of middle and last name. So you are allowed to follow only one uh, method or only one type of name here then only your data will be unified and will be of use so either you write first name and last name separate in uh, both the co two columns or either you write all the first name and last name in single column either you write full names of all the persons like full name but follow only one method for name because other up database may there will be some sometimes there is first name sometimes sometimes there is first and last for sometime there will be first middle and last this will not work you will have to follow one style of data entry tabhi aapka data jo hai it can be utilized for multiple purposes Now, see, अगर आपने first name लिखा if you write only first name, so there may be chances कि कई बार first names will be same. There may be two Tejas, there may be two Sachin, there may be two Surbi, there may be two Abhay. It's possible. So you have to take care of these things. Here surnames comes uh, comes in picture. So यहाँ पे this is also possible that there may be two Sachin Patels, there may be two Tejas Mete, or there two, may be two uh, the Surbi Lohiyas, right? There may be two Bittu Kumar Jaiswal. It's possible. Case rare, hai, but it's still possible. Okay. So, if it's middle name, then the possibility is become ho jati hai. Redundancy ki jo possibility hai, or the repetition hai, उसकी पॉसिबिलिटी मिडल नेम से और भी कम होती है इसीलिए मेनी टाइम्स जो बड़े डेटाबेस होते हैं वो आपको मिडल नेम पूछेंगे ओके नाउ सेकंड रूल ऑफ राइटिंग नेम्स इधर यू राइट ऑल द नेम्स इन अपर केस और लोअर केस अगर ये भी नहीं है तो राइट इन प्रॉपर केस What is proper case? 
as per the excel language proper case is each word is capitalized in this case proper case means each word will be capitalized in this case please remember this thing because we are going to learn formulas related to this case how to convert the, your names in proper case upper case and lower case so please remember these cases upper case all uh, uh, letters will be capital capitalized lower case all letters will be uh, the small one and uh, <coughs> this proper case first letter of each word will be capitalized so for example you have uh, asked your colleague to enter the names of all the employees and sometimes he mentioned uh, the names uh, in capitalized uh, each word or sometimes he will write this only small letters or sometimes he will write only capital letters so if you want that data to be unified all first letters capital so one formula can help you we will learn that uh, after uh, some time or in probably probably in next lectures but remember these cases and yaha par bhi you are going to use only one method either write all the names in upper case or you write all the names in lower case or follow the proper follow proper case this should be unified so jaise name likhne ki style you are going to make unified pick up any style first name last name, first middle last first and last only first or first last whatever this uh, last first and middle any style but stick to that style kyunki agar एक पर्टिकुलर स्टाइल से मतलब पर्टिकुलर टाइप से और पर्टिकुलर मेथड के अलावा कोई दूसरी मेथड अगर डेटा एंट्री में यू आर गोइंग टू यूज सो हो सकता है कि समटाइम यू विल बी फेल्ड बाय फॉर यूजिंग फॉर्मूलाज और कुछ काम आपका हो नहीं पाएगा उस डेटा पे सो इट्स वेरी कंपलसरी टू यूज सिंगल मेथड और सिंगल स्टाइल so these two things you are going to remember for uh, write uh, in case of writing names follow single style for all the names and follow single case upper lower or proper for all the names this will make your data uniform or unified okay now let's come to next uh, data type or format of data c5 c4 what's here in c column data first class c1 C2. Date, uh, yeah, year, date of birth. So I would like to ask, huh, are we clear? Is it clear to all the uh, all the things which I have told you uh, in case of names? Yes. Okay. Okay. Now let's come to dates. Now uh, let's come to dates. Date of birth C1, C2. Okay, now every one will type uh, his or her own date of birth in different ways. First way will be the regular one, D D M M Y Y with slash. D D M M Y Y with slash. For example, my date of birth is 10th September 1999. So here, 10. at the line left one oh just let me the line left at the line left one a e a e, space a uh, space r r a bird space the bird the line is all vertical line is all one c2 hmm. so here first entry will be 10 at the 0 0 slash 0 09 9 0 09 slash 1 slash. 9 9 9 this will be the first entry now second the line default for the line default c3 now second will be dd mmyy with dash this is the international format ha huh? date uh, means uh, using dash is international uh, standard so dd mmyy with dash but dd mmyy is uh, indian format international is mm ddyy 
so let's do it 10 dash 09 again 09 dash and uh, this one 9 9 9 9 okay this will be the C4 C4 Okay, now sometimes uh, some people write like 10 September 1999. Some will write 10 SEP 1999. Some will write like 10 dot 09 dot 1999. Some will write like 10 dot 9 dot 1 This you are going to avoid. You are going to pick single format and for your entire database you are going to use that format only any any format you can use ddmmyy or this uh, mmddyy with the with slash or dash any one you can use but make sure all the date of birth or all the dates in your uh, database are entered by using single uh, method in excel i will strictly recommend you use dash instead of slash because all the excel formulas understand dash they can understand slash as well for dates but you will have to uh, put that slash with the help of uh, that uh, formatting or uh, this uh, formatting styles Okay, so 0 to type karne pe 0 ja raha hai. Okay, we will see. Uh, usko bhi, we will correct. There is option uh, number formats in home tab. With the help of that, it can be rectified. So, we will rectify that later. But we are uh, studying the formats of writing dates. So, make sure ki aapke database mein sari dates ek, ek hi format se likhi jaye. Koi bhi format use karo. But it should not like this key first date is uh, ddmmyy with slash, second is ddmmyy with dash, third is mmddyy with slash and uh, next will be like uh, dd or month ka naam likha or year likha. Or it should not like this key, uh, let's write third, third entry here. C5, C4. Let's write uh, another entry like 10. That is the line left 10. Dash. 9 9 9 dash 99 9 So this can be the uh, another method Let's write by using another way 10 space 0 0 6 0 6 0 0 space 1 so this can was kuch log is tarike se bhi dates likhte hain but align default vertical align default c6 it is difficult to understand this kind of dates for excel some will write 10 space sep space 1999 some will write 10 space september plus 99 so bahut sare tarike hain lekin koi bhi tarika aap follow karo but it should be standard one which is in india ddmmyy with dash or uh, internationally it is different all of you must be aware of that okay so that's all uh, about dates is it clear to everyone Normal cursor. Okay, you have dash type kiya hai, still it comes in slash. Okay, so we can correct it with the help of formatting functions. So we will see later how to uh, correct these things. Okay, so it's possible that you have to enter in Excel. Mein kuch cheeze, uh, different uh, se enter ho. 
but we can correct these all the things using formatting functions that we are going to study later so let it be koi bhi ek tarike se date enter hone do and let it be but just remember these are the ways when you will work on particular data you may find ki kai tarah kai tarike se dates likhi gayi ho sakti hai but you are supposed to make this unified so wahan pe aapko koi bhi ek tarika you, you are going to decide any one way of writing dates and you are going to correct all the dates uh, in that way only then only you will be able to analyze the data perfectly और कहीं पे ऐसा भी हो सकता है देर 